Hi there. So I just wanted to address an issue that I found on Utrack where people were complaining that there are no um, similar ways to over overwrite properties as there are to overwrite methods. So um, for example, in Laravel, if you create a model or in, in other implementations of like ORM, um, you'll quite often want to overwrite the property of a class you're extending in order to get the ORM to work properly. So if we take a quick look here, I've got a, just a Laravel project. So if I open my terminal here and do uh, PHP artisan make uh, model uh, video, for example, um, which will create the class. And then if we open that up here in app video, and let's close this out. So quite often what you'd want to do is to override some of these properties to change some of the default behavior. So for example, if we change the property table, it will um, change the name of the table we connect to. And if we change the name of the primary key, blah, blah, blah. Now the ticket says that um, if we go back to where we came from, the ticket makes a fair point. If we do command N to generate, we can override methods which gives us a list of methods to override so we can pick the ones that we want to override. And there's no similar um, functionality for properties, which means that people are complaining that they have to go into the model class and find the property that they want and um, you know copy and paste it back into where they came from. Now, just to let you know that while it is true we don't have a, um, an implement, uh, an override property functionality in the generate box, you can do that quite easily with code completion. So I'm just inside of the class video here. If I do dollar, you can see I straight away get a list of things that I can override. So here's all the protected properties or protected static stuff that I can override. So if we want to, oh, I can't remember, was it called key or primary code? Oh, it's called primary key. And then we can um, override the name right there. So there's just a quick uh, just a quick update on how you can do that quite easily. I'll post this to the ticket. Um, let me know what you think. If you still think that we need to, you know, for parity, need a, an override properties as well as override methods, let us know on the ticket and we'll see what we can do. Thank you very much for watching.